This video is about weddings. Now, there's a couple things that you're going to have to keep in mind. I'm going to talk about a couple types of weddings. One, of course, is the Bride of Christ and a regular wedding. Now, in a regular wedding, you have to have all types of things to make that day go off perfectly, you know. Did you order the flowers, the three-tier cake, if that's what you ordered? The reception hall, the photographer, if that's what you decide to do. A DJ, if you have enough guests to fill up the dance floor. These are things that go on. But what's most important is having a bouquet. <laughs> so I'm going to share with you some stories about weddings for a moment and you know I found these slippers wedding slippers go with that so you can be comfortable the day of the wedding and I know a little bit about weddings so I'm gonna talk about it so that you can hear a little story behind this this. I was going through my stuff and I've always wanted to get married again and I always said you know wouldn't it be nice if I had some things that I collected in a little treasure box and just heirlooms if not it would go to my niece and I had collected antiques a white table everything was white so when I heard about Jesus coming for his bride, I said, well, I'm getting ready for a wedding, a, a really beautiful experience. I didn't realize we were going to be transformed. We're not going to be bringing these things with us. <laughs> I know that's uh, the story, and that's true. But, you know, to get your hair done on the wedding day, your nails done, like, look, your nails aren't going to be looking like this, of course. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I wanted to talk about wedding days. Like, I have a one-tier uh, tray, and I'm thinking about, like, a three-tier tray and things that you would have for the dessert table to the buffet table, everything that you would want on that day playlists, all those things that go into having a wedding. And the tuxedo, the rings, everything that you want to make that day perfect. Now, I said all this because really the Bride of Christ is different. You are preparing for a wedding, but maybe not in the same sense. You're preparing for the day you are transformed and you are you go from incorruptible to you go from corruptible to incorruptible and you are changed and the wedding feast is much like what I described you probably won't have a DJ per se you probably have music but you will have fantastic experience much like what we have when we call a wedding so when I think about weddings I still prepare that treasure box full of things that you never know if you're running down that aisle or you're running away <laughs> and I want to thank you for listening to my story on weddings I think you it's true though when it comes to the wedding day for the church. We want to be prepared spiritually. Thank you for watching.